Is the torch not burning out? Anyway. Second part of the tutorial. It's been three days, and this prophet has yet to show himself. I hope I'm not making a huge mistake by trusting him. War Chief, the clans are assembling as you ordered, but it will take them some time to reach us. Then we must prepare this camp immediately. I want my warriors to have food and proper lodgings when they arrive. Yes, War Chief. Warrior, has there been any word from Grom Hellscream? He and the Warsong clan were supposed to have been here by now. No, Warchief. We haven't heard from Hellscream in some time. Damn it, Grom. Where the hell are you? More importantly, where'd that grunt go? The blinking button at the top of the screen indicates that your quest journal has been updated. To find out more about your objectives, click on the quest button. Peons can harvest gold from gold mines such as the one located here. To begin collecting gold, select your peon and wait. Once a peon has been ordered to harvest gold, you will automatically travel back and forth between the gold mine and your closest great hall. Here are a few additional peons. To increase the rate of gold collection, order them to harvest. You have just placed a rally point for your structure. Whenever a unit finishes training from this building, he will automatically travel to the rally point's location. To place a rally point, select one of your unit producing structures and right click on the ground where you want the rally point to appear. The amount of gold that you currently possess is displayed in the upper right portion of your screen. As peons return to your great hall with gold, your gold stockpile increases. Training a unit takes time. When your Great Hall is selected, you can see a progress indicator in the bottom middle portion of your screen. larger population, additional orc burrows will have to be constructed. Burrows provide the food that allows you to train more troops. To construct a burrow, select one of your peons. What do you want? Now click on the build structure button in the command card. Ready to work. Notice that additional buttons are now available in the command card. To construct an orc burrow, click on the build orc burrow button. To increase the rate at which you collect lumber, train additional peons and assign them to harvest from the forest. Ready to work! Now move the mouse to where you want the building to be placed. Once you have found an appropriate location, left click to begin construction. I think I'm going too fast for the poor man. Ready to work! Mm -hmm. Need anyone near as much peons for this? Burrow. I can do that. Work, work. I think this game is better than World of Warcraft, which was supposed to be in sequel. It's much funner. Work complete. contain various upgrades that can be researched. Orcs have war mills, humans have blacksmiths, undead have a graveyard, and I believe the elves have the hunt. Work complete! Oh. There. Upgrade building. Now that your burrow has been...
Congratulations. You have accumulated enough gold and lumber to construct a barracks. Yes. This will enable you to train additional Something troops for your army. To I construct a barracks, select a peon, click on the build structure button, and click on build work. barracks. Be happy to. Now that your barracks is complete, you can begin training grunts to reinforce your Research army. Complete. To train a grunt. Continue producing grunts until you reach your quest requirement. The mid and the barracks would be quicker, but the tutorials so don't really need it. Disappear, which you will never explain. So as you can see, the more units you have, the less resources you get. Which is a bit of a pain. My life for the horde. Relaxing. My life for the war. But now it's not. You orcs are in violation of the Alliance Internment Act. We've already captured one of your leaders. If you surrender now, we'll spare your lives. War Chief, they say they've captured one of our leaders. Maybe they're referring to Grom. I hope not. But if they have captured Hellscream, I'll make them regret it. Lothar Ogar! Come, my warriors! We must drive the humans back! And we're back. And these two are fine. Regard, no regard, Ogar. die. The 
the wretched humans have been destroyed. Master, move Thrall and the rest of your forces across the bridge and locate Grog. Get there, yes. get there. Work, work. But... One of your structures was damaged during the fight. To repair a damaged building, select a peon, click the repair button, and then left-click on the desired structure. Let's get on with it. Dub. Yes. I'll go back that way in a minute. Hmm. For honor. For now. Dub. Let's get the treasure that I know is up here. Master, I am the warship. What do you want? Look, regard, no girl. Yes. Going to need that healing for where we're going. Yes. Time Troll. to die. You Let's people. get on with it. Look, you can't attack me, can you? No, you can't. Your towers have no arrows in them. Master? Spilled for treasure. Your time has come. The sheep had no treasure. Dabu. For Is honor. Treasure over here. Yes. Dabu. I am the war chief. Do you have any treasure? Sheep? Serves no purpose to For me. Honor. Sir. Good evening, yes. footmen. Dub. My life. The spirits speed up a little bit. So if there is treasure in these. For honor. Dub. 
years. For honor. Yes. Check for honor. For the loot. Yes. None will survive. Pity the humans. They really don't have anything. Yes, War Chief. When you control multiple spellcasters at the same time, it often becomes necessary to quickly switch between them to cast their individual spells. By using the subgroup interface, you can do so without having to try to select them individually. Notice that the currently selected units are displayed in the mm. bottom middle portion of your screen by little portraits. Yes. One of the unit portraits Look, is highlighted with a yellow glow. This means that it is the currently activated subgroup. You can switch between subgroups by pressing the tab key or left clicking on one of the portraits that is not highlighted. This activates that subgroup and displays their spells in your command card. I love how these two didn't even care. They just murdered their buddy behind them. For honor. My way to purge spell is completely useless to us right now. It's good against spell death. Literally, there is nothing over here. For Doom Hammer! Okay. War Chief, we found where they're holding Grom, but the area is protected by fortified guard towers. What do you want? Then destroy them! Hellstream no must regard. be huh? Time for killing. I am. I have no healing abilities and this is going to be painful. Don't know how I'm going to get through this. Your time has come. I've lived through it once. For Doom Hammer! I'll live through it again. out of here now. We're leaving the human lands for good. Finally, follow me. I have an idea. <laughs> we can set sail 
on the humans' own ships? <laughs> Perfect. But we'll need to wait for the rest of the Horde. The Horde is assembled, Warchief. We await only your command. Now, go, young Thrall. Sail west to the lands of Kalimdor. It is there that you will find your destiny. It is there that your people's salvation will be assured. We did it. But you should have some. Let me know if you want to know the rest of the story, or if I should just do what I plan on doing, and that's playing regular default Warcraft. And what I mean by that, I mean this, and like this, or I can do whatever the heck I want to do, and battle wherever the heck I want to. Who have the first expansion? I'll catch you all next time.